Kurt Blank. Oh, actually, I just want to get rid of myself. I don't need that. There we go. Yeah, I just wanted to say um, uh, happy birthday, William Aarons, and let's take a quickie look and uh, see what was going on on May 26th on your birthday. I'm not going to go through them all, let other people take a look, but because, uh, I mean, obviously some things that I may find interesting may not be interesting to other people. One there, 1805, Napoleon Bonaparte assumes the title of king on your birthday, king of Italy. That's pretty cool. Um, there's another one. I think I just take a quick look. Uh, was there anything neat here that they mentioned um, for World War One? Well, not here, but we're going to go look at it later. That's for bloody sure. Oh, look at that. 1967, the Beatles' Sgt. Pepper's Lonely Hearts Club Band was released on your birthday. Well, kind of, if you know it in the same day kind of thing. 1969, the Apollo 10, uh, Apollo 10 returned to Earth. Neat. Um... And what was the birth that I was like, you lucky bugger. Uh, for me, anyways, I was like, wow, that's pretty cool. Uh, 1913, Peter Cushing, man. Lucky, lucky devil, William Aarons. And then let's go to this one quickly. I'll show this, share this tab instead. And there it is. Um, May 26th, the German army um, of the Neiman was formed under the command of General Otto von Bilow who had previously commanded a reserve corps until under the 8th Army. The army was meant to create diversionary action against the Russian armies to distract them from the Gorlitsa Atarnov offensive planned to break through the Eastern Front. The original 8th Army was dissolved in September and only to be renewed using the diversionary army under von Bilo. And I also, and I'll just yibber yabber quickly on the, um, on the, maybe I should, uh, nah, it doesn't matter. I'll put on my, uh, my, Reading glasses quickly there, William, for you. Uh, on the 26th, uh, there was a Zeppelin raid on South End in England. And the Austro-Germans gained successes in severe fighting around Shemish. Uh, and uh, they mentioned that the Unionist Party uh, meeting at the Carlton Club in England uh, decided in favor of the coalition government. So that's it, uh, Mr. William Aaron. So I hope you have a freaking awesome uh, day today. And, uh, oh, that's for the 25th. That was the day before you were born. And uh, so that's it. Hope you have a fantastic time. Thank you so much for um, being, part of, uh, being part of my channel, man. Okay, that's it. I'm going to hit the, uh, the thingamajig, and that's the end of that. Bye.